Hi, everybody. It's Katrina Lockhart here in beautiful Palo Alto, California at the Beta Shop Studios. And I'm sitting with the lovely electric scooter with the seat, the Okai Vito scooter, right beside me right here. And I got to take this baby out for a test drive the other day. It was so fun. It's stylish, it's classy looking, and it's a very smooth ride. I had a lot of questions when I first test drove this thing, and I was like, okay, how fast does it go? How much weight does it hold? All these questions. But at least today, we are addressing a lot of the questions that you may have as well in our Frequently Asked Questions FAQ. So let's get started. And one of our first questions is, what is the maximum weight permitted on the Okai Beetle scooter? The answer is 220 pounds. This fits 220 pounds, you guys. And when I was seated on it, uh, it was just so comfortable. And it has really comfy seating right here with absorption shock going on underneath the seat. So as you're riding down the street or on the sidewalk, it kind of moves with you, you know, and it feels very smooth of a ride. And so I didn't even notice um, the bumps and things like that in the road. Another question in our FAQ is, how many hours will it take to charge the battery? So the really cool thing about the Okai Beetle scooter is it has a rechargeable battery. And if you guys can actually see in the front right here down below, there's a little flab that you can plug in the charger. And it just plugs into an outlet like a regular charger would. And it takes um, less than six hours to fully charge. I personally like to charge it you know, after I use it and things like that. It can go up to a 25 mile trip. And so that's pretty far. I like to go out and get my morning coffee on the scooter. It's compact and it can fold down, so it's so cool that you can keep it out the way by your table as you're drinking your latte or whatever you're doing. Maybe you and your kids all have an Okai scooter and you guys go, you drive down to get some ice cream or something like that for family time on a Saturday morning or whatever day you guys like to get ice cream. Back to our FAQ, this is a really good question. I really like this one. Are Okai electric scooters waterproof? That's a really interesting question. So the Okai Beetle is waterproof to some degree, but we really, really do not want you trying to drive this into water, you guys. Maybe like here in California, you know, the Bay Area does rain sometime. So if you're maybe riding it really quick, you know, to get coffee or to pick something up and go back to your place, like when I go back to my apartment, if it's raining, I'll wear my raincoat and the scooter was fine. Then you can bring it in and park it somewhere nice and dry. The Okai Beetle um, ingress protection rating, you know, it is protected basically from low pressure water jets from any direction. And so that's a really good feature that the Beetle has. Moving on to our next question in our FAQ section. It says, how long will the battery last on my Okai vehicle? That is a really good question because I thought about that question too. If you're riding the scooter, how long does your battery last? You know, do I have to buy a new battery every year? How does that work, right? So on average, the electric scooter battery, it will survive three to five years, which is equivalent to about 400 to 500 charges. And so with the 400 to 500 charge cycles, every time you plug it in, it's considered a charge cycle. Every time you plug it in to charge it, takes less than six hours for a full charge. You get a few hundred of those in um, and your battery will last through that process, you guys. But there's also a number of factors that go into your battery um, health, such as how often do you ride it? Are you riding it once a day? Are you riding it 50 times a day? Are you using it just once a week or once a month for leisurely strolling or something? Or do you need it to like really um, get to where you're going every day? And then also, are you charging it regularly and things like that? That all plays into the health and life cycle of any battery, but especially the Okai Beetle battery as well. So three to five years is a pretty long time for a battery to last. And if you're just joining us, we are here at the Beta Shop Studios in Palo Alto, California. But you can come into any of the Beta locations, you guys, any of the Beta locations. Get one of the Beta testers and say, hey, I want to try out and take the Okai Beetle scooter for a test drive like I did. And it's a free test drive. It's free. It com you come in and you ask a beta tester to take you out for a spin. You will be able to test drive this 
and your family will be able to test drive it. It is meant for um, people who are 14 years old or older to ride. So if you're 14 years old or older, come on in for a free test drive and you can see for yourself how smooth this baby is, how fast it goes, and you'll be able to practice and get some tips from our beta testers and stuff. The next question in our FAQ says, are Okai Beetle scooters swappable? So the answer is that the scooter battery is swappable and you can um, directly connect to the charger and you can remove the battery and use another battery. So it is swappable. The battery um, charges through a charging adapter cable, okay? And the cable does come with the scooter when you get the scooter. You can go to beta.com and see the scooter online right there and then you can also go to Okai's website and see the scooter and it does come with a charger when you do pick up a scooter of your own, okay? Back to our FAQs, our frequently asked questions. The next one, ooh, okay. The next one says, does the Okai Beetle have cruise control? The answer to that is yes. And so to hold the throttle, and on this side, you guys, um, is the throttle to make it go. You can slow down or you can speed up with the throttle. And if you hold down the throttle and press the function button um, for a couple seconds, for just two seconds, then you can activate the cruise control setting, which is so cool. So, 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 so cool. And I think about cruise control, you know, when you go on trips to places and stuff like that, it's nice to maintain speed because maintaining speed makes for a great ride, it's smoother ride, it's a consistent speed, and so cruise control is great because you're not always on that throttle, like just being so aware of it, you know, you can put it in cruise control and kind of relax and chill and just go down and handle your business, run your quick errands, go get a coffee, go grab an ice cream, um, whatever it is, whatever season it is, you know, you can go and use it to get whatever you want from the restaurant down the street. Or maybe you want to go check your mail and your mail is within 25 miles or less away from your house or your apartment. Or if you're in the city, maybe you want to go to and from your friend's apartment. Um, it's just really, really cool that you can use cruise control as you are using the Okai Beetle scooter. Very good question. Next on our FAQ is, can Okai Beetle connect to the app? That is yes. And before we get into that question, actually, I wanted to point out that there are, are three um, different ways to use your key because you have to start it in order to ride it. And so I have the key right here in studio and the key looks like just a normal key, like a key fob. And if I turn it around, you can use the key function to um, unlock and start the beetle. You can also, tap to start the beetle right on top there's a cool screen and um, we like to face the okai up and then we tap it and then it turns on but the third way is to use the app which is so cool because on the app you know you can put the app on your phone you can put the app on your tablet you just download the app and you're able to sit there and function and use the app the app is really cool because you can also see the charge life right you can see if your battery needs to be charged, how low it is, like, oh man, maybe I need to run an errand. Did I charge my Okai Beetle? Like, how much charge do I really have? You can really see all of that from the app. And if you're like me and you lose your key, <laughs> sometimes I lose my keys, it'll be in a purse and I change purses, or maybe it's in your pant pocket and you're like, oh man, where did I leave the key? This is really cool that the app allows you to use your Okai Beetle scooter without the key. Um, highly suggest that you keep up with the key, but the app is so cool to use. It's so convenient and you'll be able to still utilize your cool scooter. And so back to the question about the app. So yes, the Okai Beetle um, does have a Bluetooth functionality and you can connect, turn it on and off. You can check the mileage. You can t check the cycling speed. You can check the positioning. I mean, this is so cool. It's also cool because if you're somebody who likes to keep track of how far you're going or what you're doing during the day and you like to log that even, it's logged for you right on the app. So convenient, so easy to read, easy to use. Um, you know, what else does it do? It also has vehicle detection. And when you use your app, you can get that as well, the vehicle detection, because if you are riding this, um, you know, on the street, 
or close to a sidewalk or something like that, especially if you live in a city like here in Palo Alto, you know, we're close to San Francisco, California. And when people are riding their um, electric scooter down the road, you want to make sure that, you know, you have vehicle detection to make sure that cars aren't coming, make sure you look, you know, and, and you're being a safe rider. And then um, if you're just joining us, we are going over the FAQs or frequently asked questions about the Okai Beetle scooter right here. This is a wonderful scooter because it is an electric scooter with a seat. That's right. You don't have to stand on this scooter. You guys can comfortably seat right here. It's a very comfortable seat. It like conforms to your body. It has shock absorbers here. So as you're riding the scooter down, you know, it really absorbs the shock for you. So it's not a bumpy ride. And when I took this for a test drive the other day, I felt like the ride was very smooth down the road here in Palo Alto outside of our studios. I took a test drive. And as a reminder, you guys can go to any beta location and the Okai Beetle scooter is going to be there for you to test drive. So come on down to your local beta studio, you guys. Your studio shop will have beta testers in store there for you to do a free test drive, you guys, of the Okai Beetle. So let's jump right back into our next question, which says, how many miles can the Okai Beetle go when it's fully charged? And the answer is 25 miles. And so when the Okai Beetle scooter is fully charged, it can go up to 25 miles, 25 miles. Well, my local coffee shop near my place is about a mile away. And I like to um, sometimes walk it, sometimes drive it. But with the Okai Beetle scooter, it's such a smooth, easy ride to just sit on here. I um, operate the cruise control functionality on there. I like to use the app to turn it on. I jump on the scooter and I go. And it's a straight path to my cafe. I can sit outside with my dog and have my coffee. And then the scooter is just right there. It folds down. But also with the coffee shop, there is a kickstand. As you guys can see, the scooter is standing by itself because on the side there is a kickstand that holds the scooter up. Um, and it's just amazing that you can prop it up right there outside with your dog um, or with your friends, with your family, whomever you're with by yourself. Sometimes I like to have alone time sipping my coffee or even tea with my scooter. And so 25 miles when fully charged it goes. Um, and then also there's some factors that do affect the range of the scooter, which includes of course temperature, um, the number of starts and stops and, and stops and things like that. So are you going on five stops? Do you just have one destination? Things like that depend and take into consideration and into account um, the 25 miles range that the Okai scooter can go. So just remember that you can always use your app, which does track all of the distance and the mileage, the charge, um, how much battery is left on your Okai Beetle scooter. All of that stuff can be tracked from the app that you can download on your phone or whatever device you are using that you normally download. Let's go to our next FAQ. Our next FAQ, okay, the next question says, how many riding modes does Okai Beetle have? Three, three riding modes, you guys. So it does have the Eco, which is the slowest mode, and the Eco is equivalent to three miles per hour or five kilometers per hour, okay? Three miles per hour, so it's really, when I do a brisk walk, it's about 3.2 miles per hour. So the Eco is equivalent to almost a good pedestrian stroll. So as fast as your power walk is the first mode, the Eco. And that saves you the most um, electric charge as well for your battery because your battery charges fully. It goes up to 25 miles. But if you do Eco, you're going about three miles per hour and it is a, you can operate with the cruise control if you would like, and it's just a very, very steady ride. And then the next mode is actually um, the standard mode, which is a nine miles per hour or 15 kilometers. It's about nine miles per hour, you guys, and that's the second mode, which is just the standard mode. And that's a clean, smooth ride as well. It goes a little faster than the eco mode, pick up you know, some speed, very smooth ride. 
Up here on the handlebars, you know, you do have the throttle, and then right here are the brakes. And what's so cool about the brakes, I noticed when I did a test drive of the scooter, is that they're really good brakes. I felt so good, I felt in control. You squeeze on the brakes, and they're front and rear brakes. And these are 10 inch um, wheels on both the front and the back. And it has front braking and rear braking. And so the scooter really comes to a nice stop using the brake levers there on the handlebars. Absolutely so cool. And the third and last mode that the Okai Beetle scooter does have, you guys, is called Sport. So for those who like to go a little faster, I mean, I can imagine my grandma doing that because she loves to go fast. She loves electric scooters, and this one has a seat, so I'm like, okay, maybe grandma would love something like this as we're walking around and stuff. This baby goes 16 miles per hour or 25 kilometers per hour, 16 miles per hour. I did go the sport, and I will say out of the three modes, sport is the fastest, and it also was really fun. I felt very um, smooth, balanced. Once again, as I said, the seat is so comfortable, and it really absorbs the shock and stuff. So as I was riding um, out here in our Palo Alto, California studios, there's a beautiful neighborhood around the corner from the studio shop, and I was able to ride in the sport mode and go 16 miles per hour and really um, see how fast it goes and see how it feels. And it was just a really fun time to do a free test drive on the Okai Beetle scooter. So I think that you guys should definitely come into your local beta shop studio and wherever you're located, go to beta.com and look for your nearest um, location, you guys. Ask a beta tester. Walk in, they greet you with a smile and say, hey, <laughs> I would love to test drive the Okai Beetle scooter. And they're gonna show you how to use it. They're gonna show you the functionality of the key, the starting and stopping. You know, you can use it as a, the key um, itself. You can do the tap and then you can also do the app. So you can do the key, tap, app, key, tap, app. Just remember that there's three different ways, the key, the tap, or the app, for you to be able to unlock and control and start up the Okai Beetle scooter, okay? So I did all three ways of starting up the scooter just to test it out. My beta tester was just so patient with me, so kind, so informative, and had like oh, all the FAQs I'm going over right now for you guys. I'm like, these are questions I had. So if I have these questions, I'm sure all of you have some of these questions as well. And the beta testers are very knowledgeable on the Okai Beetle scooter. And so when I did go out for my test drive, I brought the key with me um, and I, I like the tap function because you know you just hold it there and it starts and you're like, wow. But I will say all the different ways that you utilize the key, you use it how you would like to use it. Some people like to use a physical key. I know my dad, he's one of those guys that he has to have a physical key in his hand. He likes to actually press the button to ensure it's on or off or locked or unlocked. Um, other people, you know, tap and go, tap and go. Maybe you have to go somewhere quickly and you don't have time to pull out the key. You don't feel like doing that. Maybe your phone, you know, is in your pocket or something. And then, you know, the tap would be a quick, easy way to start. Other people I know love their apps. People love technology, love their apps. It's so cool that this Okai Beetle scooter here operates off of an app as well. And you can go ahead and start and stop it. Check your mileage check everything about the scooter, including the current charge status and things like that. So if you're just joining us, we are going over the frequently asked questions or the FAQs for our electric scooter with a seat, the Okai Beetle scooter right here. And this is just a really cool technology right here because it's electric and it has a seat and it has three different modes of driving. You can go eco, which is a pedestrian speed at about three miles per hour. Then there's the standard mode, which is really nice because it's a smooth, cool nine miles per hour. And then sport, and I loved going using the sport when I did a test drive of this because it goes 16 miles per hour, you guys. And I was just going down the road, wind in my hair, just like, I just really enjoyed how smooth it was and how comfortable the seat is. 
Another um, detail I really wanted to point out that I noticed by test driving myself is that there's a lot of feet room right here. Your feet fit very good. I had on um, big rain boots actually when I rode this and that actually fit here on the footrest because it's such a big um, size. And so you can sit comfortably with your feet like this as you're on the scooter. I was very comfortable. I was laid back seated. It does have the um, shock absorbing technology in here as well. So as you're riding down the street, you can have a cruise, very calm, very smooth ride. I really, really love it. So let's get back into our FAQ. We do have an important question. And the question is, does the Okaibito have shock absorbers? See, I knew, there, I knew that would be a question that everybody had because that's a question I had when I was testing it. And I noticed real quick, based off of how smooth the ride is, there has to be some cool technology in the seat. There just has to be. So that's actually a really good question. And the answer, of course, is yes. The Okai Beetle does have shock absorbers, you guys. The soft cushion and spring under the seat right here um, gives it an effective shock absorbing technology right there. And it just moves as you move and as the, the scooter itself moves and as your body weight moves on here. It just kind of flows together and absorbs the shock that you get when you're riding outdoors, right? When you're riding on the sidewalk or in the street, you need something like that to really keep up with the traction and everything. And so um, weight, weight is a big deal for a lot of us, right? We have to make sure that we're riding something within the weight limits. And the weight limit here is 220 pounds, you guys. 220 pounds, it's great for the family. I know I'm an auntie of four. My eldest um, is turning 14 years old this month, actually. Her name is Simone. She's going to be 14 years old. And you have to be 14 years old or older to ride the Okai Beetle scooter. This is an electric scooter with a seat, you guys. And I would love for Simone to be able to come in the shop studio with me here in Palo Alto, California, to take this for a spin and test drive it, have the beta testers come and talk about it and show us how to use it. I would love for my niece to like grab the key and she can either use the key, she can tap, she can use Auntie's app. I have my phone on me at all times and I have the app already downloaded and ready for when I get my own Okai Beetle scooter. And it'll just be so cool to use the key, the tap or the app to operate this very cool electric scooter with the seat. Another thing I noticed when I test drove the Okai Beetle scooter was you know, it was very balanced and it was very easy for me to ride. It's as safe as riding a bicycle, you guys, okay? So if you ride a bicycle, I believe this is um, a really fun thing to do if you like riding bicycles or things like that because this is electric. It does have brakes here at the handles. There are braking levers at the top of the handlebars on either side. The brakes work for the front and the rear. 10 inch wheels we have here. Really, really cool tires. The tires actually are very smooth as well as the shock absorbing seat. And that really creates such an ultimate smooth ride, you guys. But don't just let me tell you, you have to come in and try it for yourself. Come in and try it for yourself. Bring a friend, bring your loved one, bring your significant other. If you have a child in your life who is 14 years old or older, bring them in. And our beta testers at your local beta location near you in the shop studio can take you out for a free spin on the Okai Beetle scooter, you guys. It's just so, 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 so cool. I did charge this up when I got home um, and the charge is less than six hours to fully charge. Mine did not take that long. It took a few hours um, because the charge was not fully depleted so I didn't have to wait as long. But if you're just getting your Okai Beetle, if you go to beta.com, you can go ahead and grab one. You can come in store and order one from in um, a beta location, wherever your beta locations are located closest to you. And you can go ahead and when you order it, you know, you can pick from three different colors. We have one color here in studio for you. This is bright and beautiful. And you can get your own. 
bring in people, test drive for free. I know we get so weird about test driving things, but it's like we test drive a lot of things that are electric, right? And why shouldn't we test drive a scooter? You can come in and test drive it, you guys. See how much fun it is. See how smooth of a ride it is. I know that my niece is going to love this. I'm going to have her come in for a test drive this week, actually. And I'm so excited for her because she needs a mode of transportation. She's 14 years old, and she's a dancer. She does ballet. She does jazz. And she also does lyrical dancing. And I love seeing my niece perform on stage. But she recently got her first internship, you guys, at the dance studio. I'm such a proud auntie. And she needs to get to the dance studio from home. And the dance studio is actually less than 25 miles away. Matter of fact, round trip, it's about 10 miles total. So she can go to and from the dance studio, you guys, in two trips, to and from, back and forth, in about two and a half trips about. And it still will be under that 25 miles. And so it's amazing that she can check her app and she'll be able to see hey, how much is my charge? And then she'll be able to charge it. And it's kind of cool for teenagers too because it teaches responsibility. You're like, did you charge your scooter? You know, you have to get yourself to your internship. So I'm just so thrilled. I can't wait for my family to come in to my local beta shop studio, which is in Palo Alto, California, where we are right now, and um, try out this beautiful, beautiful electric scooter. My favorite part of the scooter, in my opinion, is the key, because I think it's so cool that I have three different ways to use the key. I mean, come on, you guys. I don't have to worry about it. I never part with my phone, so I will always have the app <laughs> running and working, um, but also just to use a key, have it in your pocket. You can have it in a backpack or whatever, and I, I have a strap purse that's really small and tiny that keeps my phone, my keys, you know, in there, and I can just grab and go. I do suggest um, that you come and test drive one of these. I do suggest that, highly recommend, because you're gonna have so much fun. You're gonna see the beauty of the technology. You're gonna see that this electric um, scooter with the seat is so great. The Okai Beetle is just so amazing, you guys, so amazing. The beta testers are really cool, very knowledgeable people. You come into your local beta shop studio, you guys, and just test drive for free an Okai Beetle scooter. This is so cool. And remember, tw 220 pounds, 220 pounds. So you can ride this, go ahead and test drive it, um, it does go up to 25 miles on a single charge. It does, the battery um, for the Okai Beetle scooter lasts about three to five years, give or take, depending on how you utilize the scooter. So it's just really cool. And it's gonna be great for me and my girlfriends as we run around town getting coffee and stuff. It's gonna be amazing for my niece who's 14 coming up because this is something that she can actually use to get to and from the dance studio for her internship and for her dance classes and everything like that. I'm just so, so excited. So come on in, you guys. Test drive the Okai Beetle scooter like I did. I had so much fun. Once again, thank you for joining me for this FAQ for the Okai Beetle scooter. I'm Katrina Lockhart here live in Palo Alto, California, the Beta Shop studio. Have a good one. See you next time.